See you and thank you for trusting News 3. I'm Blake Eason and tonight for Phil Scoggins and Teresa Whitaker. Leading us off, a former Columbus court employee accused of stealing hundreds of thousands of dollars in public funds could soon be pleading guilty. Willie Dems was indicted in federal court back in August. Our News 3's Chuck Williams has been following this story and joins us now with the latest. Chuck. Blake, there's a hearing scheduled in U.S. District Court tomorrow morning in front of federal judge Clay Land. Recent court documents indicate, indicate Demps is ready to make a deal. Willie Demps was chief deputy clerk of the Muskogee County Superior and State Courts for almost three decades before he abruptly retired. Demps and seven alleged co-conspirators were accused of stealing nearly a half million dollars in court funds over 10 months in 2019. Six co-defendants have pleaded guilty in what authorities say was a check cashing scheme out of clerk accounts. An FBI agent told the court the amount could have been in the millions going back to 2010. According to a January 13th motion, an assistant U.S. attorney told the court a possible deal was in the works. Quote, the United States and defendant Willie Demps are negotiating a plea deal in this case. The parties anticipate that defendant Demps will plead guilty to a superseding information, which includes a charge of tax evasion. Amelia G. Helmick, Assistant U.S. Attorney. Demp's attorney Charles Cox of Macon told me this afternoon he will not have a comment prior to Tuesday's hearing. The U.S. Attorney's Office does not comment on pending cases. Blake, back to you. All righty, our thanks to Chuck for that report. Curtis Porch, Doreen Porch, Terry McBride, LaMarcus Palmer, George Cook, and Samuel Cole have admitted to their roles in the conspiracy. Only Demp's and his mother-in-law, Rosalie Bassey, have not entered guilty pleas.